Hey everyone, my fellow creators, today's video might completely change the way you make videos. Who's there? <sighs> Just the wind. I really need to chill out. Yeah, that's all it was. Looks amazing, right? Now imagine this to create an animation like that you'd normally need at least a week or two with professional software. But with AI, it took me less than 10 minutes thanks to ChatGPT's newest model, Sora 2. So where did this idea come from? Last week, I treated myself to dinner at a fancy restaurant. While waiting for my food, I opened Twitter and everyone was talking about Sora 2 ChatGPT's new AI model. So I tried it right there at the table, in just two minutes, I made my first animation. That night, from midnight till morning, I fell into a rabbit hole testing prompts, discovering tricks, and learning how to turn ideas into fun AI animations like these. Most people are still using stock videos, but now's your chance to stand out. Make your videos more lively and unique with AI-generated animation. So grab a cup of coffee, sit back, and watch till the end, because I'll show you the complete process to create AI animation using Sora 2. Let's dive in. First, to create short stories like the one you just saw with consistent characters and natural dialogue, you'll need to follow the exact format I'm about to show you. With this method, you can create both short and long videos. Sora 2 is still quite new, so results might vary at times, but once you get used to it, it's super easy. Step one, come up with a video idea, something fun, cute, or even a little humorous. To make it easier, you can ask ChatGPT for help. Don't worry, I've prepared a complete prompt for you. If you already have your own idea, just describe it clearly so ChatGPT can build on it. Today, I'll use an example I've already created. This prompt uses a storyboard format which helps keep your characters and backgrounds consistent. After pasting it into ChatGPT, it'll generate 10 small ideas using the same structure. In this example, I chose the theme A Halloween Party that turns into a birthday celebration. The story lasts about 50 seconds, so I divided it into 10 parts, roughly five seconds each. For each 10 second part, we'll need one storyboard image. Each image includes the background characters and other details like cake cars or props. All the sample prompts are available in my free community Google Doc. Just open the file, copy the prompt, and paste it into ChatGPT. ChatGPT will create two types of prompts, one for characters and one for backgrounds. Do this for each part of the story. To generate the images, I use Google Whisk. It's free and delivers great quality. Just paste in the prompt and it'll create two images, one for the character and one for the background. I've already made a few to show you as examples. In this example, there are three characters, a man, a woman, and an owl. I created all of them and here are the results. Now we move on to the second part of the story. This time, you don't need to recreate the characters, just generate new backgrounds for each section. Once you have enough images, we'll move on to the next step, Canva. In Canva, choose the YouTube thumbnail size, then upload all the images you just made. Start with the background, then place the characters on each side of the frame, one on the left, one on the right. Once it looks good, download it and name it Scene 1. Repeat this for the next scenes. When you've got all your storyboard images ready, it's time to move to Sora 2. To access Sora 2, you'll need an invite code usually shared on this website. Grab it as soon as new codes are available. Then upload your first storyboard image and paste in the corresponding ChatGPT prompt for scene one. Wait a few seconds. And there it is, your very first animated scene. Pretty awesome, right? Perfect. Everything's ready for the Halloween party.
If your first result doesn't look right, don't worry, just tweak the prompt and try again. Sometimes it takes two, three tries to get it perfect. Then upload your next storyboard and repeat the process. I also had to experiment a few times to make both characters move smoothly. Once you're happy with the result, keep going until the whole story is complete. Perfect! Everything's ready for the Halloween party! Guess what? I brought a little surprise! <laughs> okay, now I'm curious. <laughs> Need a little help, birthday boy? Uh, maybe. <laughs> you caught that, huh? Every second of it. Thanks for saving me from myself. Mary, what's inside this thing? You'll see. <laughs> Surprise! You didn't think I forgot, did you? I... I really didn't see this coming. Make a wish, birthday boy. <sighs> okay. <laughs> best Halloween ever. And best birthday, too. <laughs> Told you. A little magic never hurts. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how you finish your animation. If you want more dynamic scenes, you can create separate images for each action sitting, walking, talking, then let Sora 2 animate them. Just make sure to follow the same time format I showed you. It might take some testing at first, but once you get used to it, you can even create full short films with AI. Just make sure your characters stay consistent throughout the video. Use tools that help keep their faces and styles the same in every scene. Then paste in the prompt with timestamps into Sora and let it automatically animate your video. Follow these steps and you'll have a complete animated video in no time. And that's how you can create an entire animated video using just one AI tool. What used to take days or even weeks now takes only a few minutes. You can experiment with different styles, 2D, 3D paper cutout, or even anime comment below to tell me which style you want me to make a tutorial on next. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Share your results in the comments below. Don't forget to like the video if you found it helpful and subscribe for more AI tutorials. Thanks for watching.